Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Evergreen. I'm your host, the Gamer Darius. Well, we're still walking around with our doofy little leaf, with nothing but a sword to our name. This is a really cool game. Like, I love the music of it, I love the environments of it. So far, of the enemies, I love that. Hmm. Probably have to go the yeah, I have to go the other way to get up that ledge. But let's ignore that ledge for now and talk to this guy. Hey, you! What do you want? Go away! You bother me. Oh yeah, because you're really doing something. We're all going to die. You, me, everybody. You only have a little time left. Well, that is a little inevitable, so you know. Then I need to know this right time. away. Can I get to Castle Rubane from that cage? Hmm. I never thought of that. That's an interesting question. How's it interesting? It's, it's just and if you unheard. can, you're not thinking of going to the castle, are you? Yes. I must go. That's not funny. Don't throw away the little time you have left. Get out of here and hide somewhere safe. But where's the fun in that, old man? Where's the fun in that? Look at this guy. He's a shave. Have you seen an old dog? Eh? I used to see him often. He seemed to like me. I've not. I'm asking you. Have you seen a dog? And then from here it just goes, I'm asking you, have you seen your dog? Which, you know, we've not seen a dog. So, we can't tell him we have. Okay, usually there's a bunch of the dragonflies that just spawn around here and ah, there's one. Two. Excellent. Give me your Palmyra pieces. Ah, ha! Ooh, and an antidote. Ah, it'll be useful. I don't know why I why the hell I broke out an accent. I'm almost sorry. But not really. I could have sworn I heard of one, another one that had spawned. The only real reason that I'm doing this is because there's this head, there's the Azure headband which they drop. I could just buy it from the store, but I really don't want to buy it from the store. Can I get up there? I don't think I can get up there. I think I even tried in my test play, seeing how I was, if I can get up there or not, but I don't think I actually can, so let's not bother. Alright. I guess we're going to have to go the other way now. You'll notice too that there's actually a useful freaking mini map. Let's go back this way a little bit. Hello? Any dragonflies? I just want to kill enough dragonflies. Oh man. I guess this melon rat will have to do. We actually don't get to the point where we can more or less farm a bunch of Palmyra pieces until we get to the... Just Castle Rubain, like in front of Castle Rubain, is the best place early on in the game that you can farm Palmyra pieces. Hey look, there's a puppy! And it's running off. Let's check around here first. I'm never ever sure whether or not I miss something until it's way too late. And look, there's the puppy. Oh, what's this? Armor of Frost. So now, well, no. And now, I'll, I never equipped the flayed skin armor. Ain't that silly of me? Oh well. Armor of Frost has less defense than the uh, flayed skin armor, but then again, this also provides some better attack power for, like, overall. Even if it looks a little doofy. Yeah, I'm not gonna defend the 
armor in this game. It is, a lot of it, uh, I think, a lot of it does look pretty silly. I mean, I'm li I'm wearing a goddamn leaf on my head. But, assuming that we get hit by this guy, that the, uh, Dragonfly's Ice Breath, this armor actually helps prevent some of that nasty, nasty damage. Not that it does much damage in the first place, just saying, you know? Just super saying. Well, let's go over and tell the old man, oh hey, we found your dig. No! What do you want? He obviously wants you dead. Someone, please! Help me! Human must die! Well, that's not a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing that he moves pretty damn slowly. Now, here's an ass thing in this game, though. Everything else in the game can block. You cannot. As far as I've noticed, anyways, I can't actually. <laughs> as far as I've noticed, I am not actually able to block. Which sucks. But then again, when you got such things as Palmyra Ornaments, you don't really need to. Woohoo! Palmyra Ore. I don't actually know what that does fully yet. Ouch. My, my sword is so close to breaking. I don't know whether or not the breaking means it's permagon or not. Alive. Can't tell if that's good or bad luck. Probably bad. Oh well. I owe you one. I'll let you through. It doesn't make sense. Why you'd want to go there? Why not just jump off a bridge? I met a girl from Salta a while back. She was going there, too. I wonder if she made it. Now go. She probably did. I think he's talking about the second character. You. That's the crest of your hand. The cursed mark. Yep. Wasn't destroying the Empire enough for you? What? Now it makes sense. It's because of you that I was attacked. Isn't it? Oh yeah, I'm just running around summoning demons sicking them on people. Of I hope you die. <sighs> I didn't just save your life or anything. Get the hell out of here. Get the yeah, he's just gonna keep on repeating. Get the hell out of here. Like a freaking insane guy. Don't blame him. He is kind of insane. Ah, the royal passage. Now this game likes to trap you. How do I mean by that? Well, this guy thinks you and poisons you and likes to do a little bit of damage. Look at him. He's just clinging, clinging like a monkey. There are other uh, creatures that cling to you and do damage, but eh. Ooh, what's a red fruit? The blue fruit provides 10. Or Blue fruit provides oh okay, provides only five, which I think I'll put into luck. Red fruit, on the other hand, provides ten, which I'm gonna pump right into the strength. Oh nope, that's the way I came. Oh shit, I did not see you there. Oh hey, sweet. I really don't have to bite now. This is the Azure Headband. Far better defense-wise and all that fun stuff besides, you know, actual resistance. But it just looks kick-ass. Alright, I better run to the next save spot, which is just over here. Oh. Yep, that guy's hitting something. Run into the shop and go ahead and buy myself some repair stuff. Hello. Well, rather just repair my stuff, anyways. Oh, oh that was funky. 
I was hoping that there wasn't going to be any slowdown in the game. Is this so I can just straight up increase it, which will repair it. It's not a terrible idea, but 750? Nah, 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 nah. I gotta have a sh talk with you, Mr. Shopkeeper. Ah, how kind of you. I'll give you a discount on your next purchase. That's right, you will. So now when I go to upgrade, it's only 375. Still kind of costly, but hey. Now it's fully repaired. I should really use my antidote. There we go. And I still got a little bit of uh, money to boot. I am, however, going to equip my flayed skin armor. Because, damn! Now I look like a badass. Alright, let's buy some ice. I believe this. life extracts. This. At least three of them. This. Can we actually look at your accessories now? Oh, we can look at one. This one? This increases our defense against ice. Don't really need it that much. Not in this area, anyways. Might as well see what sort of creature notes we can buy. This guy is called Chanticleer. It looks like a penguin wrapped up like a mummy's piece. Might as well. Not any good weapons I actually want. Not off the top of my head. Oh well. Let's go ahead and use one of my life extracts. Please. And exit. Now this place can be a little touch annoying. Oh, crap. Pretty much any time that you change your weapon, change your items, whatever, you have to go in and change what your Palmyra action is. Bit of a butt, but you know what? I understand it. Now we got a new item. Fallback Club. Which we're gonna have as our auxiliary item. For good reasons, trust me. I love cleaving these guys. They're so kinda cute to kill. Now just down here you'll see, well, there's a giant ice crystal. I can't do anything about that. That's where this flayed skin armor comes in handy. Because Fireball! <laughs> Balls. And we got a mask. Let's see. This mask it does reduce both my strength and my luck, but it does increase my intelligence and resistance. With no Palmyra action, because as her headband doesn't have one either. Uh, I think I'll just keep with my Azure headband for the now. Actually, if anything, I should have changed the color of my Azure headband. That would have been nice. Now, also in this area is these weird magician creatures that teleport all over the place and are a pain in the ass to actually kill. I had actually meant to use chain combo there, but that works. Now use that bridge. This area is trapped. How do we know it's trapped? Well, if I were to go out too far over this ledge, then I'd end up getting shot with uh, more spears. I'm not going to demonstrate that because that sucks. Well, bye, aren't you imposing on your little chair there? That's yeah. I think we'll just do fine. How dare you enter here? Pretty easily. I mean, I just fell down off that ledge. You should really get that checked out. I mean, that ledge. People are going to be able to crawl through this place. He's not listening to me. He's just coming over to crush me. Sadly, this is actually the best weapon to use against this guy. Well, a crushing weapon. I guess that makes sense. It's just, ow. 
just, you know, oh hey, they give you a crushing weapon. Well, I don't know if it's the crushingness or the fact that it does a butt ton of uh, leaf damage, too. I don't know. We'll find that out later, maybe. Probably never. And boom! Ooh, a door. Ooh, Palmyra Whore. Ooh, a chest. And guard boots. Which give us... Boots! Man, all these things reducing my luck. Maybe I should just pump up my luck. Now, right through here is actually the way we came. This is the bridge that leads to, well, literally just back over to the save point. Oh, hi, Chanticleer. Oh, crap. Now, if I could find those magicians, I could actually show you guys how much of a pain in the arse they are to kill. Although, if you are lucky... See? They teleport all over the place. They throw rocks at you. Sometimes ice. They're magicians, after all. I was not lucky in the fact that this guy did not drop an axe. Because that is what they drop. They drop axes. Don't ask me why a magician that throws around fire, or that throws around ice and earth attacks drops only axes. I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and save, because I haven't saved in a bit. Glorious. Now we can use that bridge to get back to where we had killed that guy. I just warned it was those dragonflies, the Barabati, I think they're called, that had dropped the Azure headband, but I guess I was wrong. No, that's right, they both do. They both have a chance of dropping it. So let's slow down around here, because right here is a Chanticleer. I'm a poet, I didn't even know it. Now again, we want to be careful with these mages, because they like to teleport around. Okay, here's a little bit of assery, by the way. There's an elevator here. If you didn't have these guard boots on, you could not actually use the elevator. You know what our only clue to doing this, to knowing this is? This plate. Put on, take position, that miraculous power. That's all it says. It doesn't actually say boots, guard. So you're... So if you hadn't, you know, gone and gotten the boots yet, you'd be thinking, oh, well, crap, what the hell am I supposed to do? Then you run this way. What's oh, that was weird. I get it. It's that lift over there, right? You want to use it? Well, you need a special Palmyra armament. You already have it, silly. Take a look at your boots. You have to wear them to ride the lift. Ready? Let's go. Well, maybe I'm not ready. Maybe I don't want to ride the elevator. Ah, let's go ahead and ride the elevator. It goes up to the next area of the game. Castle Rubain. Which, this is actually one of the better grindy spots because of those guys. Well, if you can get past the guard attack. And if you don't ex Oh, Jesus! Enemy placement in this game is completely random. You pretty much just need to get behind him in order to kill him. And, whoa, look at all the Palmyra apart pieces they drop. What was I at before? 800? Around that much? Now the thing that sucks about those guys... 
is that Wallace, they drop a lot of Palmyra. Oh, Jesus. Wallace, they drop a lot of Palmyra pieces. They are not weak. Or they gain health back if you try to use a crushing weapon. So the only other weapon that you have, assuming you didn't grind before a bunch of enemies at this point, is your only weapon. Or, what was I saying? Anyways, yeah. Let's go ahead, go to the save point, and then I'll call it a video here. Oh. Nice place. Alright. I'm going to pause the video here. And when we continue, we shall make an attempt to get into Castle Grubain. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.